before we go into uh, the panel, I thought it'd be good to just set some context around the patient experience. How many people actually know what patient experience means? Excellent. That's exactly the answer I was looking for, so I thought we might need a, a bit of an introduction. So just really in terms of what is patient experience. Now, um, uh, just a bit of context about uh, Energet, because they uh, very, very proud to be the knowledge partner in the organization at the conference here today, and the organizers wanted to, me to say a little bit about, you know, what is really patient experience. So at NHS, we're an Australian company, but we also work with clients in Australia, um, US, partners in the UK, uh, and also started up in Malaysia at the start of this year. So I've got my Malaysian team here with me today. But one of the things that was really interesting when we started working in patient experience is that we don't just work with hospitals. So you'll see there we work with health insurance companies, uh, Uber and NIB, uh, we work with um, private clinics, public sector, we work with technology companies, because the patient journey is not just in hospital. So they go across the whole health sector, buying supplements, going to pharmacy, um, getting health care and wellness at home. Their journey is very broad. And so when we think about solutions for the patient experience, sometimes we just stick to this, which is just the hospital journey, the doctors and the nurses. But really when you see it from a patient perspective, their journey is much broader. And so when you're thinking about solutions for them, sometimes we have to think a lot broader than just the hospital side of so, in the organization, sometimes we, when we think of patient experience, we think about patient satisfaction or customer satisfaction surveys. We think about customer service. Some of you are measuring net promoter score. You might call it consumer engagement. Uh, as I said, it might be surveys. You might be calling in patient feedback, patient complaints. You might be calling in a qualitative research or quantitative research. And some of you might be calling in capturing patient stories. All of that is the patient experience. Okay. All of that is the patient experience. So what we're talking about and what the panelists we're talking about, we'll be dipping into all these different areas of the patient experience and how that relates to your hospitals and your business. So just to set the context and just to throw over to um, uh, the panelists next, why is patient experience important? Well, if you look at um, some of the data from the US, looking at hospitals across uh, the entire US, those hospitals that had better patient experience and patient satisfaction showed higher profitability. Um, and at the same time, uh, if you listen to some of the experts, the, those uh, hospitals that had better patient satisfaction also seem to show uh, better quality and safety measures. 